morning, one, all, everyone. Hope you're all having a great day. Welcome along to episode number 98 of Jack and the Ryan's Road to NASCAR Glory. And it is the Southern 500. It is the Bojangle Southern 500. The other race you won the hot seat in. And we're only a couple of races away from starting the playoffs. Kurt Busch, he's pissed. He's been pissed for a while. But uh, that's because Jackie has 18 victories on the season and he has none. Chase Elliott uh, is second, then followed by Brad Keselowski, Bill Byron, Matt Benedetto, all with victories earlier this season. Then Carl Busch, Denny Hamlin, Clint Boyer, your top eight. But 16, they go through to the chase, and that is Kevin Harvick, Joey Logano, Eric Jones, Kurt Busch, Eric Amarola, Martin Truex Jr., Ryan Blaney, and Alex Bowman. Suarez, I think it's between Suarez and Bowman now for that last... Uh, P16 position, 167 victories on the season, and without any further ado, she doesn't really need to, but we'll get her practiced, we will get her qualified out there, and we'll see if she can follow up last week's, last year's victory with Penske, with a victory for Chip Ganassi. NASCAR's in Darlington for the running of the Bodangles Southern 500, this unique egg-shaped oval, known as the track too tough to tame, has become home to the throwback weekend. Join us as we celebrate seven decades of NASCAR. Shall we begin then, folks? Cody Ware, he's a drafting buddy. Daniel Suarez isn't, but he went down to bat for an engine change. And Jamie McMurray, him to the back as well. Oh boy. Jackie's not on the back, though. She got pole, and she's flying. But we don't have a throwback, sorry. And the green is in the air. Let's go for the sub 500. From pole position, my girl. Oh, yep, she, I don't know what it was, right? But when she came here in the last season, she was struggling. I don't know whether it's a Ford thing or a Chevy thing or what, but... She just came here and she absolutely hooked her something up. And that's what we love. We love when she hooks something up. Would you just give me a second? There's a hair on my microphone. Yeah. You may have heard it uh, come off. You may not have heard it uh, come off. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So she found some... I don't know what she found but she found something. And now she's gonna try and make the lady in black her personal you know water. And that's, that's what you love. You love seeing it when Jackie makes it a track her personal bit. She does it at Bristol. Richmond, she made Richmond her whatever. I think she did the same with, um, oh, a bit slidey through turn three and four up against the wall as well. Excuse me. 21 laps left in stage number one. That you, uh, that you love to hear. Oh, and then she hits the wall on the outside of turn two. You can see on the uh, you can see on the track map there that uh, you've got two corners that are oh. <laughs> as much as I know you'd all love to, we're not gonna talk about it. Oh oh my god, did you see that restart? Oh my lord! That, that, that was a restart. She just literally exploded out of a fucking cannon. That is what we like. Absolutely love that restart, girl. Let's have, let's have more restarts like that, if you don't mind. Well, I would think we, uh, we don't mind uh, that kind of restart, but... Uh, oh, well. I hope... Uh, Hope everyone gets their fix in as we get 17 laps left in stage number one. And she's up against the wall here at uh, the Lady in Black, and she's up against the wall again. And she's not careful, Kyle Bush is up against her ass. 
it's important for Kyle Busch to remember the line, please stay away from uh, Jackie's bottom. Jackie's bottom is not fit for human consumption. Well, actually it is, but uh, it's one of those... Uh, one of those uh, sonic rear ends. And I am absolutely sure about that. But you can see, she just doesn't have the car control at the moment here in stage one. What is going on? This is not uh, this is not the Jackie I saw in practice. This is this is a different Jackie. This is uh Well oh, there you go. Fruit there, that's it. Fruit turn for three and four. Now come on, get back into the rhythm. 15 laps left. It, it is a long lap here at um, Darlington in good old South Carolina. Ooh, she got nicely off turn two there. And then you see how the uh, you see how the corner pinches up going into three and four with that uh, spotted white line there. And then when you get out, it opens up again. On this main straight, you can be three, four, five wide down this uh, front straight, and we have a caution. We have a caution. We have a caution, and it looked like I saw it there. Who, who was that? Oh no, we got people pitted. We got Brendan Gorn, Landon Castle. Somebody uh, re did the dirty up at the front there. So whoever it was in six, I didn't uh, notice it there. Let's see if anyone's out. If someone's out, then we know who it is. And go again. No, there's no one out. So uh, obviously whoever it is just took some tyres and uh, went with strategy. 11 laps left in uh, this stage. As we go through turns one and two, it's Kevin Harvick in second place, followed by Brad Keselowski, Joey Logano, Kyle Busch. But uh, as long as they all fight each other, guess where Jackie's going? The other way. He goes the other way and uh, she's all glad to join them. Oh, oh, she got, oh, she got loose mid corner there. That's not good, but she's already up at three seconds here. She's found something and she's found something good. See, unlike, uh, unlike other YouTube, uh, channels we're not a scripted channel here we're not the best we're not uh, anywhere close to being the best but we're not scripted everything you see here is 100% accurate and true Oh, sorry about that, folks. I'm, uh, I'm being a bit distracted uh, at the moment by something. But, uh, wow, has she got a gap? She's got a nine-second gap. Got Brad Keselowski, Joey Logano, Kyle Busch, Chase Elliott. In the uh, in the top five, six laps left in uh, stage number one here. As we go through turns uh, one and two, I'll tell you what, I'm starting to feel uh, starting to feel a little warm, and that's uh, that's not good. Five laps, uh, five laps left. I 
coming down the back row. I see the bat markers coming in. Look at that. We've got a 13 second gap on Kozlowski. What has she found? Four laps uh, left in stage number one. She's coming up to the back of True. Oh, oh wow, well, she went for a gap there and Truex blocked her off. What were you playing at, Truex? Jesus Christ. Here's Cody Ware. <laughs> Cody Ware in the same position he was last, uh, last week at uh, Bristol. Now, how are we going to get through this gaggle here? Parker Klingerman, BJ McLeod, Corey LaJoy. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Who's that? Uh, well, there's BJ McLeod trying to make Jackie's life hell. Paul Menard there, I think, at Ubley. What's BJ doing? What was, what was BJ doing uh, there? That's the end of stage number one. BJ lost control of his car there. Must have had a tyre go down. Oh well, everyone is going to be uh, pitting. That's uh, that's what we like. We'll make a few uh, make a few changes for her. But uh, she went down to P9. Uh, below the white line, I wouldn't be that uh, far below the white. Uh... It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. To it, there's Ryan Blaney. Wow, Ryan Blaney's dumbass. What is he doing? I don't know uh, what he was uh, doing there. I don't know what he was uh, doing there. But uh, here we go again, she's in P7. Watching P6 now. Up the inside of Kyle Busch and Denny Hamlin and Chase Elliott. Oh, that was that was tight. Now she's got to go drag race with Joey Logano down to turn one at stage number two here. She's got him. She's got him. There you go. She got him, but folks, into turn. She got him. 20 laps left in uh, stage number two. If she can start uh, pulling away, that would uh, that would be the strategy, folks. Give me while I alter my seating position. Get a little more comfortable. Ooh, she got very loose there uh, out of turn two, but well, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. We cross the uh, cross the zebra stripe. Oh, and we have a caution. We have a caution.
We have a caution there, folks. Ooh, look at this. I tell you what, look at this throwback livery that uh, Brad Keselowski's got. That is sick. We, we, we don't have a throwback livery. It wasn't in the budget, unfortunately. That's why we're using the Advent Health livery this weekend. <laughs> <coughs> Somebody has retired, though, on, uh, on Pit Road. But uh, the main thing is she's... Uh, She's going. She's got, she's got, oh, is there Chase Elliott's behind her now? Brad Kozlowski, Joey Logano, Kyle Busch, your uh, top five. Hmm. Yeah, I wouldn't be laughing too hard there next door. It's, it's not really a laughing matter, because Darlington is a really tough track uh, out there to tame, as you got, uh, what was that, about 13 to go, something like that, through turns one and two around the Lady in Black. She's a good old lady in black. When the lights come down. When the lights come down, this track turns into a different animal. Who that car is that's uh, retired? I want to get uh, I want to get some information uh, on that car. Don't uh, don't know who it is. We might have to wait to the end of stage two to find out who it is. But she seems to have it uh, absolutely snug where she uh, where she needs it at the moment. Absolutely snug. That's what we like. We like seeing it when she's absolutely snug into the wall a little bit. But that's 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 absolutely fine. We can keep it like that. I have no issue keeping it like that. Through uh, through three and four, she comes now. Brendan Gorn for first car. Who is that car? Oh, I never saw that car. Just briefly. You get past Landon Castle before turn one, that would be brilliant. And she gets it slowed down as well, so she doesn't hit the wall. That's uh, that's the kind of thing that we love. Past Paul Menard, Matt Tier. Oh, good lord, get past all these cars, including Cody Wears, dumbass. She's uh, up to the back of Corey LaJoy now. It's all getting a bit hectic and frantic. She's trying to put as many cars a lap down here before the stage ends in seven laps. But you just know there's going to be another caution, and it may be Ty Dillon in a second. You know, Ty Dillon's dumbass. Or it may be someone else, because there's a slower car up here. Who, who is that slower car? Let's uh, get... What the... <laughs> Ty Dillon, man! <laughs> oh. Hey, Ty. Hey, pal. Oh boy, Ty Dillon's dumbass has brought the caution out.
don't don't you uh, don't you just love it? Absolutely right. Green in the air again. Let's go racing once more. So we got four laps left. Paul Menard. What's Paul Menard doing up here? Has Paul Menard pitted? If Paul Menard has a pit, this is uh, this is an easy stage win for Jackie. And more to the point, who are these two cars on pit road? I bet one's Ty Dillon. You know, Ty Dillon's dumbass. Let's see if we can see. Oh, Ryan Blaney's one, and I don't know who the other car is. And I know that yellow and green uh, livery anywhere. There's a orangey livery, maybe Newman? I haven't seen Ryan Newman uh, all race. To be fair, it actually looks like in the right uh, position for it to be Ryan Newman. Two laps uh, left in this uh, race. through turn three and four now come on Jackie come on keep it uh, keep it nice and neat keep it nice and tidy one to go presented by credit one bank in this stage and then we can get to the end not worry about it we're fine dandy hunky dory doodly diddly thank you very much god bless in fact we are coming through uh, Turn three and four now, and that is going to be stage winner Jackie Devine in the second stage here at Darlington. Boom! Right. Paul Menard disappeared. I think Paul Menard didn't pit, if we're being uh, completely honest. Right. Well, we need to pit. But the good news is, with us pitting now, I think we've turned this into a one stop race they turn this into a two-stop race. Ryan Blaney and Matt Benedetto are out. Ryan Truex and Paul Menard are pitting. So everyone else here, and so is Brendan Gorn, everyone else has to make one more stop. We don't. Well, we have to make one more stop, but they have to make, I think, two more. Because they pitted before the end of stage uh, two. So we'll see as, uh, what the hell is Paul Menard doing? What the hell, Paul Menard? It's, uh, the pedal's somewhere else. Who's this, uh, give her a push? It's Brendan Gorn's dumbass, I think. Uh, but, uh, while we're doing that, welcome along, folks. Uh, if you are new to the channel and, uh, you are enjoying what you're seeing, enjoying what you're hearing, etc., please feel free to hit that subscribe button for me. We are at 624 subscribers at the time of recording. Looking to get to a thousand by March. Hopefully, we get to 700 by the end of this month. I'm hoping so, anyway. If not, we're going to be pretty close. Uh, also, feel free to hit that notification bell. You get notified when uh, new episodes uh, go online every Monday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday belongs to F1 2019 and NASCAR Heat 4. Uh, working on a 3 and 2 system. Uh, and as of this Saturday and Sunday, as you see, Jackie just absolutely flying through the field here. She is flying and not giving two you know what as uh, Joey Logano tries to uh, put her in the wall and Joey Logano is about to pay the price. But no, he saves it. Uh, yeah, every Saturday we do, and Sunday we'll be playing different games until 32 Days of Horror starts in a couple of weeks' time. Now we've got to get past Jimmy Johnson. There you go. Nice. That was easy as you like it. Not 
looking. Uh, what have we got in top four? Here we've got uh, Kozlowski, Harvick, Kyle Busch, and in the lead is Chase Elliott. Get past Kyle Busch, it's just Jackie and Chase Elliott for the race lead here. She's got the lead, so that's that's the uh, that's the thing now. She's got the lead, but can she keep hold of it? No, oh, full Tokyo drift. Absolutely full on Tokyo drift, folks. That is uh, oh, we have a caution. Eric Jones brings out the court, or was it Austin Dillon? Or was it Jamie McMurray? Or Paul Menard? Or Brendan Gorn, Landon Castle, or any of those three? We don't know. We honestly, uh, we honestly don't know, folks. But uh, here we go, then ready to go green in stage number three. And uh, she is, she's not got the restart gear this time, but uh, she's got to out drag, uh, I think he's 32 laps to go. I wonder if they're getting close then to make it on one stop. Oh, she got very loose out of turn two. Didn't need to be that loose. Coming down. Uh, Down uh, what turn one and two to get loose again? No. Nope. Uh, so across the stripe, thirty to go. She's, uh, she's remaining cool, she's remaining calm, and she's remaining confident, folks. That is what, uh, that is what we're looking at here. We're remaining cool, calm, and confident. She can just keep pulling out this gap and then get a nice enough gap. Good. She's going to be very good. But coming up uh, around turn three and four, around Darlington uh, Speedway, Raceway I should say, there's the strike there, 28 to go. So close to that wall. I, I don't like it when she gets that close to the wall. I really, really don't. But she's uh, she's continuing onwards now. I think a fuel run, if I remember rightly, was 24 laps. And we've got a slow car here. Two slow cars. Get out of there, where's Parker Klingerman and Corey the Joy? Ooh, that could have been uh, that could have been a disaster. Especially yeah, there's a third car on pit road. You see that? Uh... You see that third car that's just uh, there? That might be Jamie McMurray. And then I assume it's Parker Klingerman that's uh, just going on uh, pit road as we try and get around Cody Ware. Sorry, Cody. Do apologise. Well, I, I apologise on Jackie's behalf, but uh... 
it wasn't intentional, that's for sure. Now, what are we going to do about Ty Dillon and uh, PJ McLeod here? Well, we're going to hit the wall a couple of times. Uh, that's what we're going to do. Aren't we, Jackie? We're going to hit the wall. Underneath uh, BJ. She's right below the white line there. I don't know if you want to be that far. Oh, I didn't know you want to be that far. Oh, and that's going to... Oh, there you go. Can we get a caution for that? Yes. These slower cars need to be out of the way. And out of the way pretty quickly. Right, so everyone's pitting. Jackie's lost 14 spots there. Did she need to lose 14 spots? We don't know. We don't particularly think so. But that's absolutely fine by us. Anyway, we're off and underway again. See what, uh, see what mischief and mayhem she can get up to uh, here as she goes into one and two side by side with uh, Kurt Busch. Kurt Busch almost losing it. She's gone right below the white line there. I think I think she had to there. She had no choice. She had no choice but to do that. Under the Starcom, actually no. I tell you why she's lost 14 positions. There are cars here that have not pitted. And one of them is Eric Jones. These are old. These are on uh, old tyres here. Oh, you don't want to lose that. Good lord, don't lose that. 20 to go. 20 to go in this race. Could be over in 20 laps. I'm hoping so. Anyway, now how are we going to get past Eric Jones? Wait till the straight. Wait till the straight. Give him, yeah, give him the bump and let him know you're there. Now out dragging. Nyom. Good girl. Good girl. Absolutely good girl. So down the uh, down the back straight. She got below that. I don't. I don't like it when she gets below the white line. I really. Uh, I really don't like it when uh, she gets below the white line. Nor do I like it when she gets tight like that. I don't like uh, I don't like a lot of this if uh, being completely honest. But you come around to the back straight. 2.8 seconds to chase Elliot. She can keep that two point uh, She can keep it uh, that in fact she can grow it. That would be even better. Oh, she gets very loose off turn two, but luckily she manages to save it. Thank heavens for the big runoff uh, at the end of the straight. That's all I'm going to say. Thank heavens for the thank heavens for the big runoff. And thank heavens for something else. Now someone's going down pit road there, aren't they? I could have swore someone was going down pit road. How come there's only three dots on pit road? There were four. I'm fairly positive there was only four. But now there's only three. What's going on? What's going on, Darlington? Has a car decided to mysteriously disappear? Maybe. Who knows? And we have a caution, right. 15 laps left, 17 on fuel. So we'll definitely make it on fuel from here. That's good. Oh, it's Eric Jones. <laughs> Who would have thunk it was Eric Jones? And his dumbass right. We'll pit. No, we won't pit, sorry. We don't need to pit, do we, Jackie darling? 
Right, how many laps are we, uh, we going to have left? About uh, 11, I would hope. But there you go, 11. I called that absolutely perfectly. 11 laps left. Going through uh, 3 and 4, 1 and 2 now, not 3 and 4, 3 and 4 is the other end of the track. Can you tell this has been a long race, folks? This has been a really, really long race. One of the longest in NASCAR, along with the Coke 600. And when you when you win this race, you know you win this race. That, that I can tell you, and that I can absolutely promise you. As uh, Jackie goes through one and two, about ten laps uh, left. Chase Elliott, Denny Hamlin, Brad Kislowski and Clint Boyer, your top ten. I wouldn't mind just uh, ten clean laps. Ten clean laps of uh, absolute finery. Well, nine clean laps now, I should say. She's, uh, mind you, Brad Kozlowski's coming. He's coming through the field, having a good fight with Denny Hamlin over third place, though. See if, uh... See if she can uh, keep it uh, on the straight and narrow as we go uh, down the back straight here. Hopefully she can uh, go down the back straight here. She's now on the main straight. Coming up for seven, yet seven to go. 29 second lap. Keep running them 29 sevens. That will... Uh, that will do me no problem. That will absolutely do me no problem. Oh, tires. Oh, we got a tire issue. Oh my god, we have got a tyre issue. Shit my brick. We have got a tyre issue, folks. We've got a right front that's starting to give up the ghost and we've got five laps left. Oh no, that is the last thing we needed. Oh, this is <laughs> we're going to need to be saved here. Come on, Jackie. Easy, easy through, easy through. Ease off. Ease off, good girl, come on. Nurse this tyre, nurse this right front to the line. Four to go. Four to go, four to go. If you have to overtake people, you have to overtake them, but don't, uh, don't waste time overtaking them. Don't waste, uh, don't waste time in the slightest. Coming down the main straight now. She's got to keep that right front uh, cool to stop it wearing. Come on, three to go. Three to go at the line. If you want to push a little bit harder, you can. You've got five percent a caught a lap to use, but don't push too hard so that you burst that tire because that is the last thing we need. Coming off uh, turn two, you can tell this is. Uh, can tell this is uh, worrying times now. Two to go. She's really backed it off in the lap times as well. She's down to the 31, uh, she's down to the 31 second bracket. She goes around Brendan Gorn. She's having to save tyres and get around this lap traffic at the same time. That's not good. 
I do not want to see a yellow now. Or if we do, it happens on the last lap. Underneath Daniel Hemrick. There you go. Get to the line and this race is official. There, good. Right, now, now you can punish the tyre a little bit more. And I, I think you can tell she knows. She knows. She's at 14%. She's got this in the bag. She actually absolutely had to do do herself justice there. She goes round the outside. Oh, we're gonna finish under caution anyway. Finish under caution and Jackie wins at Darlington, folks. That was worrying. Very worrying uh, indeed. <sighs> P1 at the throwback race, folks. Let's have a look at the Exalted Race recap for you. Eric Jones and Alex Bowman trade, make contact. Oh, aggressive goes around. Eric Jones lost that on his own. I don't see Jackie anywhere near him. Jackie wins stage number one. Oh, the car looks a bit of a mess, girl. Pass for the lead on Joey Logano. Thank you. Ty Dillon makes contact with Jackie. Oh, there was nowhere for Jackie to go. Ty Dillon's dumbass. <laughs> she still won stage number two at a canter. It's always nice when she wins these these feature events pass for the lead again on Chase Elliott yellow flag flies on lap 67 for Matt Tift I assume here is it going to be for Matt Tift maybe not Michael McDowell and Eric Almarola make contact Oh, that's just bunching up. Pass for the lead again on Eric Jones' dumbass. We love passing Eric Jones' dumbass. And then she makes contact with uh, Jimmy Johnson, Martin Truex Jr. And aggressive goes around. And that's it, really. Sorry, there's no more. Really sorry. Yeah, mate, so we finish under caution in a bad-tempered Bojangles Sub 500, mainly because uh, they all wanted to uh, they all wanted to be violent. Well, if they want to be violent, Jackie can do violent, and she can do violent in the worst way possible. But she can also win, and that's what we love to see. We love it when she wins. <sighs> Plus, she gets her face on that trophy finally. Well, she got to get it two in a row because she won. Uh, she won last year, remember, with Penske. Oh, you love to see it. You love, 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 love to see it. Love, 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 love to see it. Love, 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 love to see it. I don't know why I'm dancing, but I am. In fact, I'll do it again. Love, 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 love to see it. Love, 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 love to see it. She was the fastest out there, 29.386. She had led 80 laps of the 92. <coughs> Excuse me! Daniel Suarez, car on the roof, that's going to help him out in his quest to get into this chase. And Martin Truex Jr. Well, nobody gave a shit. Let's go then. I mean, there's nothing more that needs to be said, really. I mean, it's all... It's all honky dory doodly diddly da, as they would say. We even get that incentive contract for another eight hundred thousand dollars, which is nice because it goes in my back pocket. And here comes the uh, the piss all over Jackie's parade. Oh, Chase Elliott's now a rival. Oh, great! That's all we needed. Yeah, we're we're going to apologise to everyone until we decide. No, fuck you. So there you go. There's a fuck you for Joey Logano. There's a fuck you coming for Ryan Truex. Don't want to do it for BJ, but you know it, these these backmarker scrubs and Kevin Harvick are getting fuck used because, well, to be honest, 
Why not? Fuck you! <laughs> so it is Indy, the last race of the regular season. That'll be uh, this Friday. So guys, 25 likes on the video. If you could be so kind, and please do consider subscribing if you haven't already done so for more NASCAR Heat 4 uh, action, more F1 2020 My Team Career Mode, whatever we play on Saturdays and Sundays as well, which is uh, going to be fun. Stay safe out there. Be kind to each other. Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. And we'll see you on Friday for the last race of the regular season around Indianapolis.